the inspection team and the inspected state party representatives have their morning meeting. The feeling is tense because nothing can be done until the inspection mandate is formally handed over, but at present Meridia refuses to accept it. Mid-meeting Malcolm receives the call from the Prime Minister of Meridia. The issues are resolved and the mandate can be officially received. The inspection team set to work straight away. They have 36 hours to arrive at the base of operations. They immediately send out a reconnaissance team to a possible location. Meanwhile, the inspected state party has the right to check over the equipment that has been brought into the country, to ensure only approved items are included and that the list matches the submitted documentation. Everything is looking very good. There are no significant problems. The following morning, the inspection team are on their way to what will become their base of operations. The equipment from Vienna, approximately 150 tons of it, is transported the last leg by truck. The team have now found their site for the base of operations. Now it's time for the setup. It is now nearly six days since Alluvia requested the on site inspection. Finally, the inspectors are ready to start work. The base of operations is ready. Now for the inspection. The hunt for evidence of a nuclear explosion begins first thing tomorrow. Of course, they're also hunting for evidence that no nuclear explosion took place. This could go either way.